I'll be happy when we drop off Sleeping Beauty. So will Reed. I saw his people off by his chopper ready to go. He's probably impatient. Look, Colonel Prentice, I got us here as fast as I could. Yes, you did, Oscar. Tom Reed's just not a patient man. Uh, Colonel, I don't mean to be pushy on this one, but I do need to talk about my pay. I was told Coburn was handling that. Well, yes, sir, but since there were these changes, you see, extra passengers with extra gear and a longer flight plan. Tell you what, Oscar, take it up with Colonel Reed. He'll take care of you. It was clear someone wanted to talk to Sam. That's why they went to all the trouble of setting them up at Coburn's. That's why they tranked them and flew them back home. They needed him docile when they offloaded him at their private airstrip up in the Blue Ridge, because if they hadn't, he would have taken that place upon with his bare hands. He's awake. Fuel is it free, man. Colonel Prentice. Major Robertson, we don't have time to chat. Our timetable says your men need to move. Everything's operational, Director Reed. We start deployment at 900 hours this morning. Good, keep things going on your end. I'm heading back to 3rd Echelon to prep things there. Oh, our people would be just fine. Never had any doubts. Now, gentlemen, if you'll excuse us, I need a minute with Miss Grimm's daughter here. There's a loose end that needs tying off. Of course, Major. Right. Fisher's all yours, Anna. You packaged him for us in Malta, you get to unwrap him here. Find out what he knows about the EMPs, how he knows it, and why he's been hunting our friend Mr. Coven. Might take a while, Tom. He's been trained to resist interrogation. I'm authorizing you to use whatever persuaders you need, chemical or otherwise. Get the answers, and dispose of them. Just don't be as messy this time. Well, I'll keep that in mind. Anything, Anything else? else? Just, Just get, get to, to it. it. And call me when you have something. I'll be at HQ. Listen to me. I'm working for President Caldwell as a mole inside Third Echelon. Reed's the new director, and he's working hand-in-hand -hand with our hosts here. A PMC called Black Arrow. They're running a pipeline for stolen Russian EMP tech through Malta. And Reed's stonewalling any kind of investigation into it. Reed's stonewalling the president. He's got serious political coverage from somewhere. And the president isn't getting anywhere through channels. We know they're in the final stages of prep for something very ugly. But what we don't know is what it is or where it's going down. Really? Then again, you seem more interested in field work these days. Stop it. I need you to do this. The second I make a move, my cover is blown. But you're on the outside now. You are free to act. I don't do this sort of thing anymore. Tell that to the men you killed in Malta. Now, if you don't make it look like you escaped and attacked me, I'm dead. So make it look good, Sam. Hit me. Do what you have to do. Grim, let me remind you I'm out of the game. You're not out. All it took was one hint about her. Only one hint about Sarah, and you dove right back in. What do you know about her? I know she's alive. How's that for starters? You're lying. Dead. Lambert told me she was dead, and I take his word over yours. She's alive, Sam, and I know where she is. I've known all along. You're lying. Why should I believe you? Because my people have her. If you help me, you get to see her again. If you don't, it's out of my hands. Do not lie to me about this, or I'll kill you. You understand me? I will kill you! Sam, I've been lying to you about this for years.
Okay. I... Okay, that'll do. Good work. Shut up. Here. My car's just outside their security gate. It's a red T-208. I disabled the GPS locator chip so Third Echelon's birds can't find it. And take this snake cam. It's linked with this phone. The signal's encrypted. In case you get lonely. So I can set up a call with Sarah to prove to you that she's alive and unharmed. Now we need to get you out of here without them coming after you. C4 should help with that. There's some right outside. Get it and call me back. I don't get the gun. Just point it at the right people. Oh, I will. Types love their sneaky ass plans, but they're never around to clean up the mess when things are. Holy shit! Grim, I've got the package. Good. Now here's the plan. They may not be able to track my car by GPS, but they've got a chopper on site that means they don't need to. They'll just blow me off the road. We're far enough out into the sticks that no one All will notice. You need to disable that chopper, or you're not going anywhere. Roger that. That would be better to hold off for that nation. Let it settle. Let it pass. There's no second chances with this stuff. You think it's really gonna work? I don't know. But I don't want to be the guy flying this thing who finds out the hard way that it did it. So, that's what you always say. And I'm never wrong, am I? What is this crap anyway? Shielding material. Well, what's in it? It's copper on top of a fiberglass matrix. U.S. Army started working on it in the 90s. You, All right, you guys affected it. I guess they're good for something. What? Something's not right. I'm gonna take a look around. Roger that. Keep your eyes open. Come and track you down! 
Give it up! I know you're here somewhere. Let's see how tough you are. Come out! This ain't gonna work, man! I know you're here. You're a dead man! Ooh. Grim, I've taken care of the chopper. Now I need to take down the field's electrical grid. Good call. Black Arrow jury rigged the hell out of the original system when they converted the airfield from civilian use. So it's vulnerable. The power relays are probably the weakest point. Where do I find them? One of the barracks had one put in, exposed inside the building. And that's my best bet. Radio check. That'll do. Keep your eyes on a dead body here. Guys, make sure Fisher is in fucking custody. Don't make me search this whole thing. I'll find you. Come on out. Watch here. I'll stand. 
just outside the gate off the main lock, but as things stand, you won't get far. What haven't you told me? There's a satellite dish on site with an uplink to a private spy bird. Use some C4 to take it out. I thought your car was clean. It is, but if they get a visual lock on you from the sat, it won't matter. Why don't you go see if there's anything else you forgot to mention? Still here, we would have found him. He's gone. 
Don't you punk out on me, asshole! I'm not done with you! Keep your head on straight, we've got this guy. You're a funny prisoner, Fisher! You're like the rats in the junkyard! <laughs> Grim, the dish is taken care of. Then let's get you out of here. My car is outside the gate. All the pursuit vehicles are inside. This isn't an accident. Fry their security attention, system. Attention, attention, all personnel. There's well an escaped prisoner inside the compound. He is to be considered armed and dangerous. Like Report to your security position immediately. Grim, the dish is taken care of. Then let's get you out of here. My car is outside the gate. All the pursuit vehicles are inside. This isn't an accident. Attention, Fly attention, all system. personnel. There is an escaped system. prisoner well inside the compound. Good thing I didn't he hit is to you be hard. considered armed and dangerous. Report to your security positions immediately. You were cleared to use deadly force. You won't be the first one buried under the shelter, shithead! Jesus Christ! The prisoner is still at large. Repeat, the prisoner is still at large. Don't worry, brother. I'm hey! Come on, you man. see that? Where did the power from? Oh, no. Show, show yourself from over there. You won't leave this airfield alive, Fisher! Don't come down on me, asshole! Where are you? Oh, I can feel it. Oh, warning! The prisoner has had extensive combat training. He is armed and extremely dangerous. Don't you worry, brother. I'm gonna find whoever did this. You gotta be close, punk. I can hear you crying. Victor killed one of our guys. Let's run this fucker down. You can't hide from me! Bad news. Sarah's fine, but I have to push back the call I promised you. Stop playing games and don't call me again unless you've got my daughter on the line.
Bick, it's Sam. I'm in town and could use a little help. If you're asking for help, we better do this face to face. And what the hell's going on back there? I thought you'd recognize the sound. Remind you of anything? Yeah. I'm Rick. Yo, Sam. How's your little girl? She's doing fine. I got a picture from her in the mail. I think her mom helped her draw. Nice. My kids don't draw me pictures or write or anything. They don't write because you can't read, man. <laughs> Lock it up. But when I get out of here... Hey, you're going to kindergarten. You know, I hear they got entrance exams at kindergarten now, Sam. I don't know if Vic's going to make it in. <laughs> Sam trusted me, because of what we'd been through together in the Gulf. That's why he called me after Third Echelon did their little number on him. He needed someone to watch his back. I was the only one who could. Oh, you're a big, you're not 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 a big, you
Mahada! Mahada! Aina Hada al Hakir! Haltara! Hadi Ajibuka Hada, you are what? هذا الأمر ما أفضل عندك أيها الحقير تقدموا تحرك اذهب 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 أيخرج وقاتل عليك كف عن الاختفاء مثل البنات الصغيرة أنا وقتك يا ابن القهبة هيا بنا هيا بنا هيا تحرك اذهب عندما أطعيكم اذهبوا هناك إنك جبان يمكن القيامة بذلك طول اليوم تعال أيها الجبان 
جبان أنا هنا آه يا قد هذا I got two for a ride out of here. Husky, this is Wolford Base. You are one lucky son of a bitch. We'll have a bird in the air as soon as we can pinpoint your location. Roger that, Wolford. We are at... We gotta move! Sorry, Sam. Husky, this is Baldwin. You still down there? Watch your ass, Basilic. Why don't you boys sit your asses down and we'll come get you? We're not going anywhere. See that, Sam? We're getting out of here! Thanks for coming back for me, Nick. You don't leave a brother behind, Sam. You don't leave family. That op started a change in Sam. One that would take years to really show itself. Years of figuring out what that change meant. But Sam's deal with Grimm meant he needed intel on EMPs and Black Arrow right now. Sam never asked for the little things, which meant this was big. The other question was where to meet. We picked the National Mall, public space, lots of crowds for cover, open approaches. It made life tricky for the spotters. I could dodge him, and Sam, he could find them, and he did. Thank you. 